we are given this normal distribution that shows the scores on a test with a mean of 89 points and a standard deviation of 12 points and we have to find how at least how high must a score be in order to be in the top 5%. So what are we trying to find? This cutoff level for top 5%. Okay, so which means that we need 95th percentile. That is, we want to get the value such that 95% of these scores are below it. Okay. So if we go to the Z table, what, what we are going to do this time is that we are going to find a value of Z such that the area to the left of that value is 95% or as a proportion 0.95. If you look for 0.95 in this region, you shall see this. That is, there are two values that come equally close to that which correspond to 1.64 and 1.65 okay so the corresponding z value would be 1.645 and which we have to transform to the original score okay and you know z and x are related by this rule all right so z has to be x minus the mean over the standard deviation in this case and uh, so what we do, we set this quotient equal to 1.645 and go with the equation solving procedure, okay? And the answer uh, would be what? 108.74 or 100.74 or higher will come in top 5%. If I was using my graphing calculator that we are using in the class, what I can do is we go to second distribution all right and then we go to inverse normal okay and uh, then we have we put the percentile as a proportion and then we will submit the mean and then enter the standard deviation all right an answer will be approximately the same all right it's 1.74 approximately okay